a tax scheme takedown. Did you try to get the $94 million refund? Only Channel 2 Action News was right there next to state investigators at a bank as they arrested a woman accused of filing a fake state tax return for $94 million. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jovita Moore. I'm Justin Farmer. The woman had little to say as officers put her in handcuffs at the counter of this bank inside a Cobb County store. Channel 2's Mark Winnie live at that store on South Cobb Drive in Smyrna. Mark, investigators say that $94 million check was just part of their scheme. Yeah, kind of two schemes allegedly involved here. So the special investigations chief of the State Department of Revenue says the bank and Kroger were cooperating, were very helpful. Couldn't have done it without him, he said. I, I waited inside, as did investigators. I got a flu shot, in fact, uh, while I was staking out the situation with my camera, while the investigators ran their scheme to expose the alleged tax scheme. By a bank counter in Cobb County. Did you try to get the a ninety-four million dollar refund? Georgia Department of Revenue Special Investigations Chief Josh Waits. It doesn't matter if it's ninety-four dollars or ninety-four million dollars. Um, we're going to go after you and hold you accountable. Says after Brigitte Jackson allegedly tried to flim flam the state into paying her a bogus $94 million tax refund, investigators flim flammed her into showing up at a bank in a supermarket to pick up a $94 million refund check, whereupon agents arrested her. Five charges, including attempted theft by taking and conspiracy to defraud the state. Waits says Ms. Jackson's cousin, Darius White, like her, claimed $99 million in income, tried to claim a mammoth refund, and faces the same charges. Though at what turned out to be a former address, agents and police did not find White, who Waits says is already on felony probation. How did you request it? Did you need it? Um... Fraud detection manager Kendra Carroll told us she spoke to a man who identified himself as Darius White by phone about his alleged refund request earlier this week. DOR financial fraud analyst Tamiko Harris says a call from Brigitte Jackson was routed to her earlier this month. You'll receive your refund in 7 to 14 business days. Yay, thank you so much. I'm so happy. You're welcome. Wait says the suspects kept calling in to check on their refunds, and that's how the recordings got made, and it contributed to the ability to bring criminal charges. Now, Darius White, if you're out there, I'd love to hear your side. You can email me at mark.winnie at wsbtv.com or call the newsroom. Reporting live, Mark Winnie, Channel 2 Action News. I'm just wondering the thought process of thinking that 94 million. I just I can't get there, Mark, but thank you for bringing us that. More details now. On tax fraud, the Georgia Department of Revenue has a new fraud hotline for you to report tax-related activities you believe are illegal. Call 877-423-6711 to notify authorities. Officials have also created a new system to better review tax returns. It includes new technology to flag suspicious returns.